Hello everyone, this is Omar. Um, it's been a long time since I did any recording or any posting on the forum. Um, so today I wanted to talk about um, journaling or logging your trades. Um, so in the last few years since I've been trading extensively, uh, one of the biggest challenges I faced was uh, having a proper tool to record or journal my trades. Uh, and, and I've tried everything. I've used um, to the, from the most basic Microsoft Word to um, the most sophisticated, um, I don't know, what is this trading log from Forex Smart Tools and everything. So everything is fine, but um, nothing really, you know, hit my hit me at a deeper level until I found a very interesting thing, a very interesting tool online. So in I think a few weeks ago, I came across something called Trello uh this is trello basically trello is essentially uh an app uh, a web-based app for making boats visual boats and that's about it but those boats can be used for practically any purpose and i have uh i've started to use it as my trading journal for the last few weeks or something a uh, couple of weeks and i have found it to be very effective so i'm still backfilling this with my trades as i find time but so far, it has been very, very, uh, very enriching, if I may just say that. So basically, Trello is uh, is a software to collaborate with teams using boards, and it can be used for practically any purpose, any creative purpose, any business purpose. I saw it being used as a sample for stock market journals, and I really liked it. So if you just see it over here. So this is uh, a sample board Trello have and I once I saw that I immediately knew this is what I wanted from a journal to look like. So what I did was I uh, pretty much copied the ideas from here and I made my own trading journal. This is my journal for 2017 and you can see what I have over here is uh, different things like my account prof my account PNL for every month and my open position details. It has um, my pending orders, my watch list, close trades for every month. So as an example, when I have an open position, uh, let's say in this one, uh, this is already uh, USD. So what I do is uh, when let's okay. So let's try making a new open position card in one of the open positions board. So what you do is you just write something. You know, your USD uh, long and let's say it's a big shadow trade. So big shadow. Then you click that and you can write descriptions of your you know entry and something the beauty is you can also attach files to this and you can use this attachment feature to attach your pictures of trades um, and you can do multiple att attachments so for example every day you make an attachment to see how the trade has progressed and this has been a very important learning feature for my trading and i think walter taught that in one of his videos that you watch your trades unfolding and you record that with the screenshot so you understand how it goes and uh, the other thing is once you are in a trade um, you can basically uh, make an update uh, by putting comments it's pretty much like putting comments on facebook which is very efficient because you can tell yourself what are you feeling about this trade and how this is progressing uh, you can have large attachments I think up to 10 MB or something um, so I for example have an attachments a chart for the entry let it open it's a bit slow today so this is my entry for example for this particular trade and then you can have a chart for this is the weekly candle I also took a screenshot once you close the trade you can have a chart for the exit as well and you can put in comments you can explore this is there's a lot of other things as well you can put you know labels you can share this with other members of trello as well so it's, it's very it's very deep and uh feature rich uh when when a trade gets closed you can simply move the closed trade into one of the closed trade boards as an example uh so let's say this is a trade i took in new zealand dollar um and got stopped out and uh, so i have now i can go back to the trade and see that okay i entered this trade over here and my exit was when this low got broken in this candle so i can revisit my thoughts which i would have written over here and i can understand what happened in the trade how could i have done it better if i could have done better or it was just one of those trades which will end up in a loss so there are a lot of features 
which can be used and it's visually very appealing to me uh, now with Trello there is another thing which works very well and I have been using that even before Trello uh, to some extent not regularly but I plan to use it now regularly the other thing is uh, Loom basically the website is useloom.com Loom is a video recording software essentially uh, it is you can uh, use it to quickly and very efficiently record videos of your trades entries exits your thoughts you can journal your videos in it it's totally free and it's very fast and it's very effective for the purpose it's very effective um, it, this is a plugin for chrome basically as you can see it sits right over here on your chrome you can just click this loom button and start recording and that's about it uh, as soon as the video uh, as soon as you're done recording the video the link to the video automatically gets pasted to your clipboard which means you can just paste the link anywhere with trello loom works perfectly because it is embedded uh, you, you can embed videos in your cards in your in your, in your board so let's say I have this entry in um, Aussie and I have embedded a loom video for the reasons of why I took the trade so I can just play it and I can easily see why I took the trade in real time this is very efficient guys uh, both loom and Trello are totally free uh, basically um, as you refer more people they are based on a reference model as you refer more people to these uh, apps or to these applications you get either more features or virtual credits which you can use for further features as an example when when I referred it for the first time my recording time became unlimited and the first time I referred it was to my to my wife essentially second time I refer it I get five dollars for virtual features which I can use they are still under development but I don't know uh, for most part for what we will need it it will be free trailer is also free and this one is also free if you refer it to other people you might get either more features or virtual credit for more features which might come in the future things like those um, that's about it from my side uh, i will post links to both these applications below the video and those links will be my referral links so if you sign up using those you'll probably uh, benefit me in getting more future features when they come and that's about it if you have any questions please do let me know i'll be more than happy to answer and see if i can be of help in any way thank you so much have a lovely day Bye bye